Good morning, saints of God. Good morning, saints of God. Good morning, people of God. Good God morning to you. Those here in the sanctuary and those connecting to us via the internet and the airwaves. All of you out there in YouTube land and all of you out there in Facebook land, all of you that are watching us right now, we say good God morning to you. Greetings to you from the Vernon Bush Church in Victorville, California. From Bishop Dixon, First Lady Lord, and all of us here that are connected together, we say good God morning to you. Give yourself a hand. This is the day that the Lord has made. He said we will rejoice and be glad in it. This is a day where we can feel good and get your smile on. This is the day where we say glory to God in the highest and on earth. Peace, goodwill to all, goodwill to all, goodwill to all. Of God's people. God has given you goodwill. If you've ever felt the love of God, stand on your feet. If you've ever felt the grace of God, stand on your feet. If you've ever felt the forgiveness of God, stand on your feet. And we're talking to you out there on Facebook and YouTube. Stand on your feet at home. If you've ever felt the good will of God, yeah, glory to God in the highest. Glory to God in the highest. He's looking for some glory from you. In the highest, raise your hands and say glory to God. Say thank you, God, for your grace. Thank you, God, for your mercy. Thank you, God, for your kindness. Thank you, God, for your love. Thank you, God, for forgiving me. Thank you, God, for my salvation. Glory to God in the highest and peace on earth. Goodwill to all God's people. Amen. Give yourself some praise. Give yourself some shout. Thank God for his goodwill. Let's go into Psalms 91. This is our canopy of protection. This is where we go to the secret place of the Most High. And we go there with our hearts, speaking it out of our mouths. So protect your heart with your hand. Put your hand on your heart, show God your love. And we'll start right there at verse number one as it's on your screen at home and right here on the screen here in the sanctuary. Verse 1 reads, He that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress. My God, in Him will I trust. Surely He shall deliver thee from the snare of the fowler and from the noise and pestilence. He shall cover thee with His feathers and under his wings shalt thou trust. His truth shall be thy shield and buckler. Thou shalt not be afraid for the terror by night, nor for the arrow that flyeth by day, nor for the pestilence that walketh in darkness, nor for the destruction that wasteth at noonday. A thousand shall fall at thy side, and ten thousand at thy right hand, but it shall not come nigh thee. Only with thy eyes shall thou behold and see the reward of the wicked. 
Because thou has made the Lord, which is my refuge, even the most high, thy habitation. There shall no evil befall thee, neither shall any plague come nigh thy dwelling. For he shall give his angels charge over thee, to keep thee in all thy ways. They shall bear thee up in their hands, lest thou dash thy foot against a stone. Thou shalt tread upon the lion and the adder. The young lion and the dragon shall thou trample under feet. Because he hath set his love upon me, therefore will I deliver him. I will set him on high, because he hath known my name. He shall call upon me, and I will answer him. I will be with him in trouble. I will deliver him and honor him. With long life will I satisfy him and show him my salvation. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, God, for showing us your salvation. Yeah. Thank you, God. Let's pray. Father God, in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you for this day. God, we thank you for this time. Father, we thank you, God, for this breath that we're breathing right now. God, we're thanking you, God, for our eyes opening up, God, and our ears hearing, God, and our hands being able to touch, God. Thank you, God, for all the goodness of your love. Thank you, Father, for all the kindness that you rendered unto us. Thank you, God, that you load us up daily with benefits, God. Now, Father, in the name of Jesus, we come to you humbly as your children, asking God and seeking, Father, for your divine will to be done in our lives, God. Father, we ask today, God, that you let us set aside every way, God. God, we ask today that you free us, God, from any sickness, God. God, we ask today that you free us from any doubt, God. We ask today, God, that you free us from any guilt. God, we ask that you free us from any shame. God, we ask that you loose the bands, God, that have been binding us, God. And free us, God, to do your will, God. In peace, God. In decency, God. In order, God. In love, God. In kindness, God. God, we ask that you bring your will to pass in our lives, God. God, we're your children, God. You said you have good things in store for us, God. Your word says there's no good thing that you will withhold from us that live uprightly, God. You said there's no good thing that you would hold from us if we do what's right, God. So, God, we ask that you guide us on the path of living a righteous life, God. And that the power of your word overcomes the power of our flesh, God. God, we ask that we raise up, God, in the power of your word and knock out the enemy that dwells in our flesh. Empower your people, God. To be doers of your word and not just hear it. God, empower your people to receive your word with a good heart, God. Empower your people, God, to receive the salvation and the peace that you have for us, God. Now, God, bless the word that is coming from our bishop today, God. God, open up the people's hearts to receive it, God. Father, we ask that they're fertile ground in the minds and hearts and spirits of your people today, God. Let their soul be refreshed. Let their soul be renewed. Let their soul fill up with joy. Let their soul fill up with goodness. Let their soul fill up, God, with the power of your word today, God. Oh, God, manifest. Manifest, God, somebody's destiny today, God to be your child, God. Somebody that doesn't know you in a pardon of their sins. Manifest, God, from the word that is preached and the Holy Spirit that is present. 
in the name of Jesus we pray. And we all say, Amen. Amen. Come on, let's bless the Lord. Amen. Come on, let's bless yes. the Lord. Hallelujah. Come on, let's yes, bless Lord. the Lord. Yes. How do you remember? You remember we come down up front and we would praise God. Come on before his presence. We're going to get this party started. We're going to take it back. We're going to bless the Lord. We're going to take it back. We're going to bless the Lord. We're going to take it back. We're going to bless the Lord. Come on now. Y'all know this song. I will bless the Lord.
worship him he's alpha he's omega he's the beginning and he's the end he is in you he wants you to worship him father receive our worship come on Deborah receive our worship hallelujah hallelujah
that praise. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Bless your name, God. Keep the praise going. Keep the love in your heart going. We worship you. Yeah, you're the beginning and the end. He was there at the beginning of your situation, and he'll be there at the end. He is the first and the last, so thank him for that. It's now time for our announcements. Our announcement will come from our sister, Elder Elect Chevy Best. everyone. Hallelujah. What an exciting day to be in the house of the Lord. These are your announcements for Sunday, August 28th already. Can you believe it's already August 28th? So here we go. Prayer 